the European Union is taking the lead to create a stronger system of ocean governance around the globe. The UN's Sustainable Development Goals for 2030 include conserving and sustainably using the world's oceans, seas, and marine resources. The Pacific EU Marine Partnership Project is aimed at protecting coastal and oceanic fisheries in the Pacific Islands. It takes a holistic, integrated approach to sustainable fisheries in keeping with the joint communication on international ocean governance. The 45 million euro program includes approximately 10 million euros in co-financing from Sweden. Ambassador Andrew Jacobs of the European Union delegation to the Pacific explains the importance of the Pacific EU Marine Partnership. Well, we've had a very long-standing involvement with the Pacific all around uh, fisheries and we recognize very much that a lot of countries have as their main resource fish. And we also have to bear in mind that uh, the European Union is the biggest consumer, the biggest market for, for fish. And a lot of uh, fish from the Pacific end up on, uh, on dinner plates uh, in, in Europe. So we're keen uh, to, to try to help ensure that uh, there is sustainable management of fish stocks uh, in the Pacific. We're, we're keen to make sure that uh, communities can really benefit as much as possible from, uh, from the fish uh, in, in their waters. Very often it is the women in communities who are going out fishing. We need to ensure that there is uh, equity in the way in which the income from fisheries is, 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 is used. Uh, we're talking about how the, the most can be made, not only in terms of uh, fishing, but in terms of tourism, in terms of uh, you know, deep sea mining. If, so I think it's really crucial that, uh, that Pacific countries do plan how best to use the huge ocean spaces that they have. The head of development cooperation of the Swedish Embassy in Bangkok, Anne Charlotte Malm, explains the basis of her country's partnership with the program. Sustainable development of oceans is naturally a part of our work since oceans are borderless and requires cooperation both regionally and globally. And Sweden supports the Pacific European Union Marine Partnership Programme since marine resources are the backbone of the Pacific country's economy and form the basis for the livelihoods of men and women. The programme will improve sustainable management and development of fisheries. The Pacific EU Marine Partnership Project is implemented by four of the regional intergovernmental agencies of the Council of Regional Organizations in the Pacific. The Pacific Islands Forum Fisheries Agency, the Pacific Community, the Secretariat of the Pacific Regional Environment Program, and the University of the South Pacific. The Director General of the Pacific Community, Dr. Colin Tukui Tonga, explains the importance of the program. I think if we just recall that 80% of the protein source for many of our communities come from the sea, it's fish and seafood, it's obviously a very important uh, contribution to the food security issues in the region. It's very important that we uh, manage it uh, as best we can. And so from uh, the Pacific community's point of view, we just want to express our gratitude to the European Union and the government of Sweden. Results expected from the project include high quality scientific and management advice for oceanic fisheries for both the national and regional level, inclusive economic benefits from sustainable tuna fishing through support for authorities and the private sector to create decent employment, sustainable management of coastal fisheries resources and ecosystems through better scientific information, legal advice, mentoring, and community empowerment, a reduction of illegal, unreported, and unregulated fishing by bolstering monitoring, legislation, information, and marine management. Promoting sustainable use of marine biodiversity with better marine spatial planning, climate change resilience, conservation, and rehabilitation measures. Capacity building through training and research and development targeting key stakeholder groups. Support for fisheries goes hand in hand with the EU's broad range of efforts to address climate change and promote sustainable development in the Pacific. And the conservation of the oceans is of critical importance for the future of the Pacific Island countries, which is why the European Union makes it a priority within our regional cooperation 
to support particularly the, the, the conservation of oceans, the conservation of, uh, of the resources that these oceans represent.